25. Status check. Go out. Uh, go center. Go L55. T minus 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2. We have RD-180 ignition. And we have liftoff of the United Launch Alliance Atlas V rocket carrying the NRO L-55 mission for the National Reconnaissance Office. We have booster PU to close loop control. You're hearing the voice of Rob Gannon providing launch vehicle Everything ascent data. Our MR valve position looks good. MTU shaft speed looks good. Flight control is nice and clean, seeing normal disturbances for this time of flight. Main engine continues to operate normally. Vehicle is now flying at half the speed of sound. Yeah, three miles in altitude, 0.3 miles downrange, traveling just over a thousand miles per hour. Already 180 continues to burn normally. Up on Mach 1. L55 is now supersonic. Flight control continues to be nice and smooth. Already 180 operating normally. We have throttled down to 95% right on time. Nice and smooth. Two minutes into the mission, everything looking good. Started Q-Alpha limited steering. RD-180 is burning normal. And the vehicle now weighs 50% of what it did at liftoff. 22 miles in altitude, 20 miles downrange, traveling at 3,000 miles per hour. Just continue to burn normally. And we fired the pyro valve, pressurizing the second stage reaction control system. Pressure is rising as expected. Next event we're looking for, bottling down to 92% thrust. Expect that in 10 seconds. And we've had the throttle down, engine continues to burn normally. Parameters look good. Passing through 200 seconds in the mission, everything looking good. Vehicle now weighs one quarter of what it did at liftoff. 52 miles in altitude. 107 miles downrange, traveling at 7,800 miles per hour. And we've begun blue space chill down. Preparing the RL-10 for main engine burn on the second stage. RD-180 is throttling down. Preparation for BECO. Blue space chill down has completed. BECO, booster engine cutoff. Coming up on stage separation. And we have stage separation. Looking good. Pre-start on fuel, pre-start on locks. Ignition, full thrust. The RL-10 is up and running normally. Good start signatures. Coming up on fairing jettison. 
And we have bearing jettison. Both brake wires indicate a good jettison. 